Hello everyone, welcome to IoT Frontier. My name is Harihar Nath. Today I am very excited to share an interesting video with you guys. Recently I had a wonderful opportunity to visit TWorks, India's largest prototyping center. Today in this video I will be sharing with you the experience of the visit, the world class facility that is it offers and also I will be sharing the innovations that are brought to life at TWorks and finally I will be sharing with you uh, an inspiring story of school dropout. So stay tuned until the end of this video. It takes time and effort to create content for you guys. So please share your support by liking this video and hitting that subscribe button so that you never miss an episode. Let's get started. TWorks, India's largest prototyping center is located in 4.79 acre campus at Raidurg, Hyderabad. TWorks is a great place to learn about latest technologies and to see how they are being used to solve real world problems. It is an innovation haven that brings together technology, creativity and collaboration. What does the prototyping mean? Prototyping is a process to transform an idea into a product. For example, you have an idea to create a robo. So you have to first design it and then create a physical product. So TWorks will help you in creating the physical product with the use of their industry grade tools and machinery. TWorks is an initiative by government of Telangana with a vision to create and celebrate a culture of hobbies, makers and innovators in India who explore and experiment without the fear of failure. Our adventure began as we stepped into TWorks, a vibrant space buzzing with energy and brimming with possibilities. The walls are adorned with inspiring quotes and the air is filled with the hum of machines and the voices of passionate creators. Let's dive into the heart of TWorks, the state of the art labs and workshops. Each lab is equipped with cutting edge tools and equipments, empowering innovators to bring their ideas to life. From electronics and robotics to 3D printing and IoT, the possibilities are limitless. There are currently eight facilities. First facility is the Advanced Rapid Prototyping Lab. This lab gives e quick and easy access to multiple rapid prototyping equipments such as digital cutting, UV printing and vacuum forming. From making prototypes of furniture for a designer to making plastic mold for a baker, this space opens up opportunities for makers and designers. On the screen, you can look into Zand G3 2500L digital cutting system, which is flatbed cutter, which can be configured to cut vinyl, fabric, leather, cardboard, foam core, rubber, and many more. The second facility we visited is Woodshop. The Woodshop is equipped with woodworking tools and machineries. On the screen, you can see 3-axis CNC wood router which can chew through wood and non-ferrous metals. The product sample from the wood shop can be seen here. And the third facility is Metal Shop. Metal Shop is one of the largest facility in the T-Works. It has nearly 6 to 7 world-class machineries. The Metal Shop is one-stop solution for all the machining, fabrication and inspection requirement. CNC turning and milling is a process in which a metal is cut and rotated to create an exact shape. In this gallery, you can see the finished products made from these machineries. You can also look into the robotic arm fitting made using these machines. You can make as tiny as small fitting to a large gear in this lab. Now you can see the pipe bender machine. It can bend the pipes in different angles to make them suitable for a wide range of applications and fitting locations. You can look into the finished pipe bend to perfection with this machinery. We also had the privilege of meeting some of the brightest minds at TWorks. One such person is the TV mechanic Rajendra Prasad from Varangal. On the screen, you can see the electric go-karting vehicle created by him using the second hand spare parts. It was completely designed and developed in TWorks with the equipment available here. 
I had the privilege to interact with him and his story has inspired and challenges our perception of what's possible. By the way, he has studied just 10th standard. So what is our excuse for limiting ourselves to excel in life? Next, we went to the product showcase area. In this area, we can see all the products built at TWorks. They range from medical devices and industrial automation to furnitures and mementos. First product we have seen is named as Holy Waste. It is a semi-automatic hand press to create incense stick holder. They wantedly created it to be hand operated so that it doesn't eliminate the jobs of the people. You can see the final product here. Next one is very interesting item which has become the official memento for the guests presented by CM of Telangana. It is the silver filigree swan. Filigree is a form of intricate metalwork used in jewellery and other small forms of metalwork. It is an art form of Karimnagar Telangana. In this filigree, the artisans twist the delicate silver wire into delicate loops. These are knitted in a form of zigzag patterns which results in an intricate lace-like appearance. It takes a lot of time and effort to create these art forms. So artists were not able to produce much products per day. So TWorks was presented with this problem statement to increase the productivity. TWorks has taken this up and created few semi-automatic tools to create the intricate designs and patterns which the artist can use to create the final product. Each creation tells a unique story of perseverance, imagination and relentless pursuit of the better future. Now we will look into the Cinemic Studio. TWorks has a fully equipped pottery studio that gives holistic experience of working with ceramics. It is equipped with high-end pottery wheels and a massive kiln. This studio enables one to come, experiment and take home a piece of their own creation. Next, we will look into the exciting 3D printing lab. 3D printing lab or additive manufacturing is a construction of 3D object from a CAD model or a digital 3D model. It is typically made layer by layer. Designers use 3D printers to quickly create product models and prototypes. This shop currently has FDM and SLA printers which allows users to choose from wide variety of materials with different material properties, resolution and end applications. TWorks also has a designated SLA printer to print medical grade products. LV Prasada Institute is one of their clients for creating surgical medical grade 3D printed tools. You can look into the products built using 3D printers such as robo displayed here and other artifacts placed in the gallery. Now we will look into the testing lab. The testing lab houses equipment like humidity and temperature chamber, an electrodynamic vibration system and a universal testing machine. This equipment will enable to quantify and characterize the prototypes and parts so that one can iterate faster and more efficiently. Now we get into the laser cutting and engraving lab. It is another interesting shop at TWorks and it can cut, engrave various plastics and woods. You can see the design in the laptop being sent to the printer and it does its job by cutting the plastic sheet into a square shape. This opens up limitless possibilities using laser cutting and engraving. Now let's get into the electronics lab. This lab is equipped with wide range of tools and instruments. One can access cutting, crimping, holding and soldering tools. Now we are done with the different facilities at TWorks. Let's talk about interesting program run by TWorks for rural innovators. TWorks provide rural innovation development program. They call it as RIDP. It targets on empowering rural innovators and communities by mentoring them in their product development journey. Under RIDP, one can get 70 to 95% subsidy in product development by TWorks. Overall, TWorks is not just a space. It's a catalyst for transforming ideas into viable products and businesses. As we conclude our visit to TWorks, we can't help 
but feel a sense of awe and excitement. The incredible projects, the spirit of collaboration and the passion of innovators are the testament of human ingenuity and boundless potential that lies within us all. I hope this glimpse into the future of innovation has sparked your curiosity and inspired you to explore new frontiers. Remember, the innovation knows no boundaries and the possibilities are endless if you dare to dream and create. What are your thoughts on the future of TWORKS? Do you think it has a potential to be leading innovation center in India? Please provide your thoughts in the comment sections below. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share this video with your fellow dreamers and innovators. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.